James's dedication <clears throat> was evident even before we hired him. Even as a ride along, he was incredibly popular with the officers. This popular, popularity with our staff carried over once he joined us officially as a full-time police officer. <clears throat> he joined us in Jan this last January. James was immediately placed in the Southwest Illinois College Police Academy in Belleville, graduating this last spring. Following graduation, we wasted no time placing him in the FTO program. And a few months later, he was on the road running solo. James was eager and enthusiastic about the profession, showing a particular interest in drug enforcement activities. But that wasn't all. James inserted himself in nearly every aspect of our department op operations. James didn't really seem to believe in the traditional eight-hour shift. The 40-hour work week evidently wasn't the way James was programmed. James often came in early, stayed late, and many times came in on his off time to perform necessary tasks that weren't always fun or pleasant, but James did it. James as a person was pleasant and fun to be around. That enthusiasm and passion that I spoke about earlier, that trait had a way of motivating those around him, and I saw it with my own eyes. I know that I speak for my entire staff when I say that James, not just the hard worker, but the young man will be missed terribly. To the family, Don, Dixie, Megan, Lauren, I offer my deepest condolences. And I want you to know this, you are and always will be a member of the Chester Police family. You will forever be connected to us. On that you have my word. <clears throat> 